Hey guys, welcome back. John here again with Zayon TV, and welcome back to the plunge for the special Halloween episode. Uh, today is Halloween, um, clearly, being that the zombie has a uh, oh crap, has a uh, pumpkin on his head. I am going to die. I am definitely going to die here, most likely. So, uh, yep, there's another zombie with a, uh, oh, two zombies with, uh, pumpkins on their heads. That's actually kind of cool. I kind of like that. I think Mo Yang did that last year, uh, as well as they're doing it this year. Um, so yeah, guys, welcome back to the plunge. Um, I know it's been a while since I released a plunge episode, uh, in about a month and a half or so. Uh, but we're back to having internet problems here. Get a and well I uh good god I'm gonna die well I decided to uh get back and start playing some more of my single player world so I got a whole bunch of work done for you guys actually uh I finished up the house that we were doing I started working on a path idea um and I started I haven't actually done this third part in this world yet I, it's actually what we're gonna work on today um, I want to start figuring out the layout of our little town thing. Um, I want it to be kind of like a, uh, like a little forest village kind of thing, uh, is kind of what I'm going for here. Um, and then maybe over time we'll build like wooden walls or something, stuff like that, um, kind of around the city. Um, I think that could look kind of cool. I'm going for a theme here. Um, I have picked a theme. Um, I'm not going to reveal it all for you guys right away, because I think if I do that, I kind of ruin it. Um, but I think what I want to do is just kind of reveal it to you guys along the way. Um, and I got to watch how long this episode is, because I don't want it to run too far over, because I have to render this video and then upload it. And the internet here is slow as balls. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and I want to talk to you guys just a little bit, but not enough that I bore you guys. So I definitely want to do a good bit of building in this episode. Um, and that's kind of why I'm down here gathering resources right now. Um, I need some of this andesite, uh, because I like using the smooth or the polished andesite. I think it looks really, really good. Uh, it mixes well with stone bricks and stuff like that. Um, so yeah. What I want to do with you guys, um, I'm going to go ahead and leave you guys here. Um, I'm going to gather some more resources, and then I'll be back with you guys um, as soon as I guess I'm ready to start. So yeah, I will talk to you guys in just a little bit. Alrighty guys, so uh, I was just down mining, like I said, um, and my pick broke. Um, so I had to come back up, um, and I decided I think I'm just done mining for the day, um, and then what I'm gonna do, uh, I'm, I think, I might have just revealed it a little bit, um, I'm gonna go ahead and reveal the house to you guys so you guys can see what it looks like. Um, so I'm gonna kind of walk over here with my head down, uh, hopefully, I know you guys have already seen the front. Uh, I also worked on a path, and I don't want to give that away too quickly either. Um, so let me get to a good vantage point. Now, I know you guys have seen the front here. Um, so this is the front. Um, and... Hello? Hello, spider! You are exactly who I wanted to see. You stupid idiot, didn't even drop string. Um, okay, well, now that I've just completely given it away, um, I want to go ahead and show you guys the path first, and then I'll show you guys the rest. I did kind of a mix of coarse dirt, gravel, and cobblestone stairs. Um, so it kind of looks like a dirt path that the grass has kind of worn away on, but has also like started to grow back in, as well as there may have been like gravel and cobblestone here in the past. Um, so I kind of like the... Idiot. <laughs> uh, I kind of like the way this looks. I wasn't too fond of it when I first did it. Uh, ignore the house back there in the background. I'm not going to talk about that yet. Um, I wasn't too fond of it at first. It has really grown on me over time. Uh, at first, I just did coarse dirt, and I just didn't like that, so I had to add some other things in. Um, so I did. 
Uh, so yeah, that's the path. I think this is the path we're going to stick with for this entire little village thing that I'm going to make. Um, but I think it might change. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, we'll, we'll get to that in another episode. I think for now, this is what we're going to stick with in town. If we're going to change it, we're going to change all of the paths. Um, so yeah. So there's the front of the house. You guys have already seen that. Um, and I'm just going to go over this very, very quickly. Um, that's the front. The sides... Um, and I know you guys are probably going to crap on me for this, but the sides are very bland at the moment. Um, and I'll show you the other side real quick. But, um, part of the theme I'm going with here is a very, um, like overgrown kind of run down look. Uh, that's part of the theme idea that I have. Uh, jerk. Go away. No, don't blow up. Don't blow up. Please, please. I've had so many creeper blow-ups trying to build this stupid thing. Stupid idiot. <sighs> Sorry, I'll calm down. Um, so the sides are very bland, um, but there's a lot more detail I need to add on the sides. I literally just wanted to get the house done and a basic design on the inside complete. Uh, there's still some leaves here that need to despawn. Um, and this is the back. Um, so it's very, very bland, like I said, but there's a lot more work that is going to go into this house. Um, and a lot of the building for this house is going to be off camera. Um, and then I'm going to do, I apologize if you can hear that screaming. That's my quad mates. <laughs> um, what the heck? Um, yeah, I'm going to do a lot of work on this house off camera. Um, but yeah, let me go ahead and show you guys the inside real quick before I start that. Um, let me just put some hovering furnace eye, um, and get some of this stuff cooking up so that, uh, I can do that while I'm talking to you guys. So I have like a little entryway here, uh, door opens in, you have a little entryway. I think I'm going to put, uh, some sort of little room here. I want to make this, this house is very small on the inside. It's very small and quaint. Um, and I like that with Minecraft houses. Uh, it's better to have it small and jam a lot of stuff in than it is to have it really big and have a lot of open spaces because it makes it not look very nice. Um, so we got a small little area here in the corner where I'm going to put something. Uh, I have a little storage area. I think this is where I'm going to store all my items down here. Um, and then over here we have a little stairway upstairs. And up here, I'm not sure what we're going to do up here yet. Um, we will worry about that in another episode. Um, but the other thing I did is I built kind of like a little loft up here. Um, and I think I like... What is going on here? I think there's supposed to be a stair here. Yeah, there is. Uh, I'll fix that later. Um, but we have like a little loft here. I'm not sure I'm too fond of the way it looks. Um, I think I might change it. Currently, it's like a rib going across here and then a rib that comes out to kind of support it. Uh, I might change the way that looks a little bit. But let's go ahead up and head up here on top. I think up here is where I'm going to put my bed and... and uh, things such as that. I have kind of like these mini rafters up here for a little bit of design. Um, I do know there's a lot of people that don't like this granite color. Um, I like it as a roof. It blends well with the uh, dark brown and the, the brown colors of the wood, I think. Um, but yeah, I think up here is going to be my bedroom area kind of thing. Uh, maybe some small little storage uh, stuff like that. Uh, so that's the grand tour. Um, I, I'll probably get comments about this. Um, I know you can walk right through here. I did that on purpose um, because if I were to put a fence here, here, and here, I really feel, and here, I really feel like it closes this area off and makes it feel a lot more like closed in and trapped. Um, so I got rid of those and just made it like this. It still looks like there's a way that it would hold you back from falling. Uh, it's more of a looks kind of thing. Same thing here, um, except being that I use stairs here, it doesn't make it look as blocky because it, uh, you see like a little drop down on the other side uh, because of the stair. Um, so that's a grand tour. Um, I think what I'm going to go ahead and do now, um, I'm going to cut and then we're about 10 minutes into the video. I'm going to cut and then I'm going to come back to you guys. There's something I want to work on this episode. Um, and I'm just going to come back to you guys with uh, some progress of what I want to work on. So yeah, guys, I will be back with you guys shortly. Alrighty guys, so um, I finished up my little project that I was talking about previously. Um, I also did a little bit of work here in the house. Um, 
I put in this little like entryway kind of thing to protect the door with a pressure plate and a crafting bench and a chest here just for uh, a little extra use if I need it. Um, the other thing I did, I also moved the cows um, down here. I had to kill a few to get them down here. But I moved them down uh, and there's just a little ladder here to get out. Is that a spider? Spider? Hello? Alright, there you are. I need your strength. Open the freaking door. I can... I can make a... Uh, a bow. <gasps> this is amazing. This is best day of my life. Time to make a bow. I... Uh, oh, I made it right! Perfect. Uh, okay. So, now that I've rambled on for a little bit, uh, let me go ahead and show you guys what I've been working on. Uh, I got 25... Is that all I got? Yeah, that's all I got. All right, let me put this away, and then let's go take a look at what I've been working on. Um, so I want to show it to you guys at night. Uh, I also added the path here. Uh, you can kind of see a little glimpse of it right there. Uh, what I want to do, I want to show it to you guys at night. Uh, this is it at night. Uh, it's not completely finished yet. There's still some stuff I have to do. Um, I want to add like a pile of coal blocks here, um, and I want to add some more uh, different ores down here in the ground as well um, to kind of... Hey there, skeleton. To kind of uh, make it look like some stuff fell on the ground uh, when the uh, person working there uh, was working. Um, so it is, as you guys probably have guessed, a blacksmith shop. Um, I kind of added this in here. I thought it would look kind of cool as just a little... Uh, just kind of shove it in the pillar here. I don't know if I like it. I might change it back and just move it back down here. That's where I used to have it. Um, but it is blacksmith shop. Um, I have furnaces in here. Um, there are four furnaces back here um, that I can use as I wish. Um, as well as I added some cauldrons in with water in them. Um, I want to add the pile of coal as well as probably some other ores in the ground right here, like I said. Um, so yeah, that's what I've been working on. Um, it's got a sandstone roof because I like the color and the design of sandstone kind of goes well with the sporadic nature of the granite. Um, so I thought it looked kind of cool. It is a mix of stone brick, cobble, uh, polished andesite, and then the alternate, like the, uh, some of the other options of some of those blocks. But yeah, I think that's it. Um, that's actually going to be it for this video, guys. I needed, like I said, I needed it to be a little bit shorter so I could get it up today for you guys uh, as the Halloween special. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this episode up here. Um, we're going to do a little bit more in the next episode. I got a good bit of work I got to do before we can do that episode. Um, but yeah, I'll be back with you guys uh, once I have... Once I'm ready to start recording again. So you guys, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them down in the comment section below. I want to thank you all very much for watching. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.